yet? That's right. Larry Hatterberg. Are you one of Hatterberg's people? No. <laughs> Hi. I'm not that special. You're not that special? That sucks. <laughs> We're back here on Jiggy Jake TV. Community Access Television, the lowest rated show on Access, but number one in hell. And of course, uh, good God, we got people watching. I, I can't deal with this, people watching me. I can't have sex with people watching me. I can't. Oh. That's why I don't do porno. <laughs> I know it's shocking. Me have sex? It's shocking. What's even shocking more is Ninja Larry's behind the camera. And uh, I know that guy having sex, that's more of a shocker, but we won't get into that here. And uh, <laughs> you guys have last, you were last on Jiggy Jag TV number four or five. I think you're going to be on 70. 69? That would be really cool, but we've boy, we've way past 69 by now. Tainted, how are you guys doing? We're good. We're good, man. Good, man. Absolutely. Go ahead and refresh everybody's memory as to who you are. All right. So the ladies can write the complaint letters and know who they're addressing. Absolutely. I'm Kevin, bass player. I'm Tim, Vox, and guitar. I'm Sheldon, guitar. Johnny K, drummer. Now, uh, you guys are... You guys were on my show before you were on any other local cable show. That is true. <laughs> That's 100% true. Yeah, absolutely. Now, uh, Very proud of that fact, by the oh, way. Oh, yeah. <laughs> There's a couple people that probably aren't proud of that fact. But as soon as we got there, we knew we were going places. Oh, that's cool. Yep. I'm, I'm glad I got a compliment. It's kind of halfway there. Yeah. <laughs> so what the hell you guys think of Salina? Salina? Well, yeah, actually, I... Uh, I lived here for four years growing up so it's kind of nostalgia every time we come back you got to visit the old neighborhood and you know but uh we haven't gotten to play the blue goat before and uh we're very very happy to be here we're very happy to be here owners of the blue goat <laughs> now uh you got a extreme couture shirt on he's still laying on the mat you know after brock got a hold of him that's from the buckle. <laughs> it's like a three hundred dollars shirt. No. <laughs> How come you guys don't have any tainted merchandise on? You're not rocking the merch. Dude, don't you know it's not cool to wear your own stuff? Well, oh, check oh. out the shirt, man. <laughs> it's not cool to wear your own stuff. Damn it. Um, <laughs> by the way, could you do that right now? <laughs> Nobody wants to see that. I don't want to break that lens. But, uh, so, what the hell can we expect out of you guys tonight? Rock. Just straight up rock. Actually, we have kind of a surprise show. We didn't plan on it, but we're going to do two sets tonight. We'd only planned on one. So, uh, we're going to open up for ourselves tonight. And uh, we're going to open up for ourselves tonight. We're going to have a whole lot of fun. So, sorry you missed it. But, uh, yeah, we're going to put some covers and just kind of jelly rock and have fun and make fools of ourselves. Mostly him. Yep. He's a damn long hair. Yeah, long hair. <laughs> now, uh, hair one one good thing, and, and Ninja Larry is going to be so happy. He doesn't have to deal with mirrors this time. Because the last time we filmed you guys, we were in, ironically, the place I got married. <laughs> we see how that marriage turned out. <laughs> in NASBAR. Have you guys played anywhere that's had mirrors like NASBAR before? Never. Not, no, no never. Not like that, never. There was a place called Randos in Topeka back in the 90s, but no, no place like that. Yeah. The floor is kicked. That, that checkered floor, like you're, oh, yeah. Yeah, you just yeah. finished the race, and oh, I felt like a winner every time <laughs> I went in there. <laughs> yeah, I'll tell you. Now, uh, give, give me a, a rundown of what you guys have been doing for the last two years and where the hell you're, you're going now. Well, we've been writing. Uh, we've been getting kick-ass rockers in the band. Um, we, uh, we, we had a great guy in the band by the name of Mo Gerard, and, uh, and uh, he stepped aside, and we got Sheldon here, and uh, he, he rocks. Uh, we did a lot of writing. We went down to Florida, uh, Orlando, this past spring and summer and recorded an album, which will be released soon. And... Uh, it's, uh, it sounds great. We did it with a producer by the name of Brett Hesla. He's the singer for a band called Dark New Day on Warner Brothers Records. You might have heard of them. Dark New Day, they rock. Um, you can rock their merch, but you can't rock your own. That's it. That's, that's the rules. That's, that's it, the rules. That's, it. that's how it works. 
So, uh, if you guys could play with any two bands, Living Dead, Broke Up, whatever, who are they? And I'm sure you guys all have individual picks. So. Oh, Alice, Alice in Chains, absolutely. I mean, that would be, for me, that's that's king, man. Those guys are king. Major influence, I think, on everybody in the band. So, who else, gentlemen? Alter Bridge. Alter Bridge? I'm, I'm going to say for myself, Metallica, even though they suck pretty hard right now, um, just to be able to... Saying anger? You didn't like that? <laughs> that was awesome, wasn't it? God, I wish I could get some production like that. Um, but no, I'd say Metallica and Dark New Day. Yeah, that's good. So, Alter Bridge, and I missed yours along the way. Yeah, along with these Slayer! guys. Slayer would be nice. Freaking Slayer? <laughs> I don't think they'd have us. <laughs> you, you, see, that, I was waiting for somebody to say Godsmack. Godsmack. Well, he's a big Shannon Larkin fan. Um, yeah, we have, a, we have a song for Sully, by the way. Just check out the new album. And no one said Vixen either, which I was shocked. Or Great White. <laughs> We don't want to die. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, yeah. Life is good. I just got married. I'm not looking to die yeah. anytime soon. <laughs> now, uh, is it true that all of Wichita pretty much just hates my guts? Uh, we all took a vote this, uh, a couple Tuesdays ago. <laughs> and, uh, yeah, it was. On the ballot, you know? it, but yeah. it was close. Yeah. It wasn't all of Wichita. It was like 63%. There are a couple strippers at it, Jezebel's, that don't like. That, that they like me, so th that's. But in your defense, it was like 4% uh, of registered voters, so. Yeah, that's right, yeah. You know, it was. I have to work this question now in with all the Wichita bands because there are so many people down there that don't like me. Joe Roach and I, actually, the last show that you guys were on, I said, oh, Joe hates me. I got an email saying, I don't hate you. <laughs> oh, my God, he watched. Yeah. Well, that's all right. I hope I didn't make an ass of myself. <laughs> <laughs> now, now, Chris last time said that you look like Brett Michaels. Oh. <laughs> yeah, where is that? Don't are you? <laughs> <laughs> I've been meaning to talk hey, to him about that. Him <laughs> where the hell are you? I did this because of you. Yeah. <laughs> Two years ago. That's all I got. That's all you got? You just got the menacing look? Well, right now I'm having a feud with Rocket Girl down there in Wichita. She doesn't like me very much. Then we probably shouldn't tell you that her sister's in the house. <laughs> <laughs> so. She's not right over there. <laughs> now, uh, what do you guys, you guys got this new album out. What is the track on it that you're most proud of? Stride. Stride, coolest thing we've ever done. I think for me it's Sully that Tim was talking about, sort of a, an homage to uh, Godsmack, if you would. Well, Naked one member of Godsmack, yeah. anyway. Is that pretty much? Yeah. 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 I mean, could be used loosely, you know, the song's about everybody like that, but it's directed for Yeah, it. it's, it's, it's really not about a particular individual. Yeah. It's, it's, you know... Bands, uh, there are such great bands with such heart, fighting in the trenches to, to get their music heard across this planet, you know, every day, just fighting, 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 living the dream, uh, just with, with the music in their hearts. And then there are guys who used to be that way, and things come their way, and they get four or five songs on the radio, and then the next six or seven sound just like that, and they kind of just... Start phoning it in. It's kind of about rock stars. Is that another St. Anger reference? <laughs> yeah. yeah. I haven't done my I Hate You Yet James song. <laughs> well, thank you, gentlemen. Pl plug the website. Okay, everybody, check us out at www.tainted.us. Name of the band, the country we live in. It's that simple. Tainted.us. And anything that was going on with us, you can find out there. You can get on our mailing list there. Please get on our mailing list. Anything big that happens, you'll be the first to know. Uh, and you get to our MySpace from there. It's pretty cool. So check it out. Well, let's go watch and perform here.